Explain us, explain us. Did you know? I'll be joining anti clockwise direction. Anti clockwise. Yet my name's I'm Huntington Kalunji. Kalunji? Yes, sir. Nice to meet you, Kalunji. Nice meeting you, brother. So, right now we are doing what we call geographical water experiment. Caused by the Coriolis effect. After pouring, you have to stabilize it. Make the water come down. Okay. After come down the water, we draw this flower on top to see whether it's going anti-clockwise. Yeah. So the farther you move from the equator, the faster it goes. The closer the equator, the slower. So let's go north and see what will happen. Let's go and see. What is he doing? Ah, uh, magic. He's a sorcerer. <laughs> Oh, that's exactly on the equator. The equator is the last. Ah, oh, the last. So northern hemisphere side now. Yes. The Coriolis effect has to change. It goes into clockwise. What changes? It's called Coriolis effect, which is make the clockwise and anti-clockwise movement. And then they say your body weight on the latitude is less by three percent. You're lighter. You're lighter in the northern hemisphere. In zero latitude. Mm. From which country? Bulgaria. Bulgaria. Southeast Europe. Wow. Have you heard of Bulgaria? Exactly. They get some Bulgarian people to come and get some. Uh, we, are, we are very curious. What is that one for? So it's turning clockwise north. South anti clockwise. Zero does nothing. And you missed last month. You know, we have March 21st. Yeah. September 23rd. Those two dates call them equinox. That's uh, equal day, equal night. That's when the sun rises and sets the On the equator. Day, yeah. uh, mm -hmm. Midday day, you have no shadow when you stand at the zero oh, wow. altitude. Yeah. So let's do the last one in mid and see. Ooh. So why do you put water there? Yeah, to, to do so the effect. To show the effect how it works. North and south. Okay. And it crosses only 13 countries. Really? Seven countries in Africa. Which countries are those? Then first we have to the name of two apples. So yes. Zero, now we need to see what happens wow. to the flower. Zero, twice, or this is zero? Zero, nothing. Wow. Wow. You don't get swallowed. Oh, that's so the countries, Africa Sorry. said you have seven, but yeah. the total number of countries are 13. Yeah. We've got Uganda, Kenya, Somalia, Gabon, Congo, DLC, Congo Brazzaville, yeah. Sao Tome. Then out of Africa goes to Indonesia, Colombia, Ecuador, Brazil, Kiribati Island, Grontal and Brunel. And three oceans, Pacific, Indian and the Atlantic Ocean. So that's what you do all day? South, north, south, south, north, south, north, zero, south, north, south, north, zero. Yeah, and then you get the certificate, you find a buy certificate. That one you charge 10,000 each. Mm -hmm. Like if you take to Bulgaria, like so many of you that you are here. So thank you very much. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you for the experience. No Whenever I go in another country, I try to learn something from their language. And Uganda has a lot of languages. I, mean, I think there are more than 30. Anyway, I learned two words in one of the languages, which are Webale, which means thank you, and Sebo, which means Mr. So Webale Sebo. I had to pay my tribute to the guy that showed us this, this information. Yes, brother. Sebo. Right. Webale. Kale Sebo now Webale. Okay. No, thank you very much. May God bless you. Thank Same you. Thing. Webale. You wanted to say thank you to him? Yes. In Uganda? Yes. <laughs> Webale.